time for a fun Friday with Celine Kempton, selenekempton.com. <clears throat> Today I wanted to show you these cool card boxes um, from Stampin' Up. They actually come like this, but I've gone and cut. Um, so from the line to the line, it's five and three quarters. So I cut at two and seven eighths down the middle. I got half a card box that looked like this, and then I just assembled it um, as is, so it stands up. I just wanted to show you how I decorated my card box for a cool team awards night that is coming up tonight. By the time this video comes out, um, we ha will have already done the team reward night, but I wanted to show you how I did this box. So I did fast views down the edge of both sides of a one and a half inch by 12 inch piece of designer paper. And now I'm just going to take it and, it, and it really does stick good, so once you get it down and fold it over the corners, you can't move it, so be careful when you're putting it on your box. So this is just going to stick directly on. You know how fast fuse it's super sticky, so just be careful as you're doing it. And I'm just going to bend this over. Oops. See? Super sticky. That's okay though, I can just adjust. Nope, once it's on, it's on. So we've got our box and I'm just gonna grab a pair of paper snips and trim the excess. I want it looking nice and clean, but it's easy because the box is there so it makes it easy to um, trim and get it perfect. And so that's it for that. So now I'm going to bring in some of our brand new twine. This is item 144625 and I'm going to tie it around my box in a knot like this. By the way, that was the first one I had to trim. I'm sure it was because I was on camera. I'm just going to tie it twice to make a knot first because it'll be easier to tie everything up when it's knotted. And um, it's easier definitely to give it a squeeze and get it nice and tight while it's here. And then make your bow. So I did loop, swoop, and pull. If you do bunny ears, that's fine. You can do whatever bow makes sense for you. But I just got a bow on there. And to finish off my little card box decoration, Um, I'm going to add one of these. They're awfully cute. They're in the new holiday mini and I will make sure that I have the item number on the screen for you um, when I finish up this video. And I'm just going to take a couple of glue dots and attach them to my item. I don't want to touch the glue dots with my fingers because it'll make it less sticky. So I just... Um, attach it like this. I touch the item to the glue dot, push down and pick up. And then, because it'll be super sticky, I can just take it and push down on my project. And boom, there it is. Isn't that cute? Okay, so next, I'm gonna pull in one of these brand new mini ornaments. Oh my gosh, in silver, it's nice and sparkly. It's kind of a matte finish. Um, I absolutely love them, mini ornament embellishments. This is also um, in the new holiday book, item 144626, sorry I'm outside the frame there. I'm gonna take this and thread it onto some linen thread and give it a tie so it doesn't move because it does move pretty good, see? <laughs> that was funny. Okay, and then I'm gonna slide it up under my bow and just tie it off. Easier said than done when you're on film. Not that you guys make me nervous or anything. Let's see, here we go. And then I'll just tie it up. So, what I put in these, oh, and that is the, I'm not gonna tie a, a bow, I'm gonna tie a knot for this. What I put in these cute little um, holders is, the make and take packet for tonight. So let me show you that. 
This is one of the new up and coming card kits and this is going to be next week's video. But all I did was I took all of the card fronts from the kit and I put them in the box as well as when you when you take this card class it you you make four of uh, five of each of four designs so all of this extra stuff will fit in the little card box to cut the ribbon for five people into the right measurement you need 28 inches of ribbon so everybody gets an equal amount and I will see you next week with more tips and tricks thanks Thank you.